I'm Peggy Scout Laborde with a piece of the past. We are taking a look back at New Orleans history through some photos from my collection or the work of local photographers and also from archives. Among local buildings that I wish were still with us was the Southern Railway Terminal, also known as New Orleans Terminal. It was built in 1908 on the Basin Street median at the intersection of downtown Canal Street. Designed by famed architect Daniel Burnham, who also planned Washington, D.C.'s Union Station, this terminal served numerous railway lines, notably Southern. It was the terminus for the Southerner, which linked our city to the Northeast, with New York as its final destination. And there were waiting areas that were spacious and even included a restaurant. A distinctive semicircular window graced the station's facade. At one point, instead of newspapers, some newsboys handed out what were known of as Blue Books, a directory of local houses of ill repute in Storyville, which was located across the street from the station. The red light district was shut down by 1917. Sadly, the railway station was demolished in 1956 when all passenger service was relocated to the new Union passenger terminal nearby. The site was landscaped and dubbed the Garden of the Americas. A statue of Latin American hero Simone Boulevard was erected a few years later. So the next time you pass Basin Street at Canal, don't forget that this was the spot where locals and visitors crossed paths, all thanks to the locomotive. That's a piece of the past from WYS. Thanks for watching.